Aloha and welcome to Hawaii Vacation News for the week of September 15, 2008. I'm Sandra Segisi and this news is brought to you by Hawaii-Aloha.com in Hawaii, Hawaii's experts. A lot of people make Hawaii's Aloha Festival the main reason for vacationing in the islands. The event is the state's premier cultural showcase that celebrates music, dance and history aimed at preserving unique island traditions. Now, if you're going to be in the islands this week, it'll be tough to miss the festivals. This year's theme is hula, the art of Hawaiian dance. You'll experience a variety of elegance in dance and music, so swing by. The festivals now encompass all the cultures of the people of Hawaii and some 30 30,000 volunteers participate in the staging of this massive production. Nearly a million people are expected this year. It all began with the Waikiki Ho'olaulea over the weekend and continues to the 28th. Don't miss the magnificent floral parade in Waikiki with female and male pa'u riders. Extravagant floats loaded with a variety of island flowers plus marching bands. The streets will be filled with excitement and you won't want to miss this. Any Hawaii-Aloha agent can bring you up to date with the schedule. Pick an agent from the Hawaii Aloha website on hawaii-aloha.com or call 1-800-843-8771. And here's a secret for you. If you're looking for a great non-touristy beach on the east coast of Oahu, along a beautiful drive toward the North Shore, you'll pass a 15-acre military reservation called Bellows, which serves mostly as a resort for U.S. military personnel. Well, if it's the weekend, don't pass it. What a lot of people don't know, especially visitors, is that the beach and recreation areas are completely open to the public on the weekends. Locals and a few lucky tourists like yourself turn out in numbers to enjoy the beautiful beach area that curves around Waimanalo Bay. There are places to barbecue, camp out, or just enjoy a long walk on this vast white sandy beach. If you've never had an opportunity to go boogie boarding, this is the place to get started. The protected bay makes it perfect for beginners. No matter what your skill level is, you can have fun at Bellows because the wave action is almost always on the mild side. It's also great for building sandcastles and playing in the shallow waters, which are perfect for swimming. Planning on vacationing on Oahu? Rest assured that transportation to and from Waikiki and just about everywhere else on the island is really easy. To begin with, just about everything in Waikiki is within walking distance of everything else. Buses are plentiful and cover the entire island. Taxis are easy access. Trolleys run specifically for the convenience of visitors. Package tours provide your transportation to virtually all scheduled destinations. And rental cars are available at dozens of locations. Keep in mind, you can't just go out and hail a cab. Traffic, parking, and stopping regulations prohibit taxis from pulling over to pick up fares in many areas, but you almost always can find a taxi in front of the larger Waikiki hotels, and it's easy to call a taxi from wherever you are. If you're not planning to rent a car, taxis are a good alternative. Remember that shopping results in packages to carry and sightseeing results in souvenirs and paraphernalia. It may be hard to lug all that stuff onto a bus and maybe too much to allow you to board. Now in Chicago, a big attraction is Improv Theater, Second City, at which audiences are treated to comedic plays that are unscripted and entirely improvised, starting with audience suggestions. Shannon Winpenny, the theater's founder, tells us about this new venue in Hawaii. The Laugh Track Theater is the only theater of its kind in the Honolulu dedicated to long-form improvisation and the training of long-form improvisation. The Laugh Track Theater is a great place to come and see local talent, local people performing, and seeing the local style of humor that's here and so prominent in Hawaii. We are surrounded by beautiful art galleries, restaurants, and other theaters, and it is a great place uh, to explore and see the art that is so unique to Hawaii and Hawaii's people. If you've experienced improv in the past, you'll welcome this opportunity to take it on on your vacation. If you've never experienced it, you're in for a treat. If you'd like more information, pick an agent from the Hawaii-Aloha website, that's Hawaii dash aloha.com or call 1-800-843-8771. Well, that does it for Hawaii Vacation News this week. Tune in again next week for more news. For back episodes and links, go to our website at hawaii-aloha.com. Until next time, mahalo and aloha. I'm Sandra Sigisi.